The Federal High Court sitting in Abuja has ordered the Department of State Service, TSS, to allow the leader of the indigenous people of Biafra, Namdi Kano, access to medical doctors of his choice. Kano's lead counsel, Professor Mike Zekome, had filed an application requesting Justice Binta in Yakor to issue the order. Citing the deterioration of the IPOB leader's health at the detention facility. He also urged the court to order the release of his medical reports. But DSS had filed a preliminary objection asking the court to decline jurisdiction in the matter, arguing that the request had been settled by another court previously. But in a judgment on Thursday, Justice Binta Iyako dismissed the objection of the DSS, saying the agency fights to respond to issues raised by the applicant regarding his health. She heard that a person arrested and detained shall have the right to demand medical attention by medical practitioners of his choice. Consequently, the applicant is entitled to medical attention of his choice but at its cost. This application succeeds and is hereby granted, the judge heard. The judge added that Gannon's medical practitioners and the DSS should be present, should, should be present whenever examination is conducted on Cano outside the DSS facility. She added that the procedure should be recorded while the DSS should supervise for security purposes. Reacting to the development, Ozekome lauded the judge for the verdict. He said he will subsequently write the DSS to a vague canal his client's medical report since the time he was extra edited from Kenya to Nigeria. That is between June 27, 2021 to now. In another developing news, the detained leader of the indigenous people of Biafra, IPOB Namde Kano, on Thursday began his medical examination in line with a court order. Justice Bin Tanyako of the Federal High Court, Abuja, had ordered the Department of State Service, TSX, to grant Namde Kano access to his medical records. The court on Thursday, in his judgment, held that Objections the security agency raised against Kano's request lacked merit. It added that Kano is constitutionally entitled to have access to both the records he requested for and the medical doctors of his choice. Justice Enyako held that the independent medical examination of Kano by his personnel physicians should be supervised by the DSS with the entire process recorded and sealed for security purposes. Sir Ifani Ejefor, Esquire, IPOB's lead counsel, in a statement signed on Thursday said Kano was profoundly excited by the news from the courts and subsequently directed that his appreciation be conveyed to his legal team ably led by Professor Mike Zekome san He affirmed that Kano's medical examination had commenced on earnest by the recommended team of medical experts with a cardiologist surgery from the best hospitals in Abuja, all duly recommended by Kano's wife. The statement reads in part, We visited our Formidable clients, Onyendo Mazin Namde Kanu today, being the 20th of day of July 2023, at the SSS headquarters, Abuja, where he is still being illegally and unconstitutionally held in a solitary confinement. Onyendo was specifically briefed on the judgment of the Federal High Court, Abuja, where Justice Bin Tanyako. This morning delivered another landmark judgment on our application for order of judiciary review. 
Onyendo was acquitted of the far-reaching orders made by his lordship today. In the landmark judgment, wherein his lordship directed the, SS, the SSX to allow Onyendo sex to medical doctors of his choice, we are to medically examine Onyendo outside the SSS facility without the influence of the SSS. The court further directed that all such examinations must be recorded. Furthermore, his lordship directed the SSS to unveil Onyendo with all his medical records. Onyendo was profoundly, uh, prof, please pardon me, excited by the news of his superlative outing and consequently directed that his application be converged to his legal team, ably led by Prof. Mike Uzekome San. It is imperative to use this media to inform Ezigbo Umuchineke that the phase one of Onyendo's medical examination has commenced in earnest by the recommended team of medical experts, which cardiologist surgery are uh, from the best hospital in Abuja, all duly recommended by Onyendo's adorable wife. We shall keep Umuchineke abreast of every development as they unfold. Onyendo is in, in total agreement that his team is joining towards a landslide victory and believing the almighty Chineke Abiyama that the future is indeed bright. So guys, I'm dropping it here. Kindly share your thoughts below the comment section. Please do not forget to subscribe to this channel if you have not. Thank you.